So, hello everybody, my name is Alex and welcome to my channel. Uh, it's in the early morning, so bear with me, I'm a bit tired, but uh, I couldn't wait to jump straight into this uh, game. Because uh, today we're starting off our new Let's Play, which is uh, the Mafia Definite Edition, or uh, the remake of the Mafia 1. And the Mafia 1 was such an incredible game uh, back when it released. Uh, it's like an iconic part of my childhood. I absolutely loved it. I adore it. So I can't wait to jump straight into this. So let's start off with a new story mode and we are going with medium I guess. I want a fair fight. Yeah I want a fair fight. Uh, and some bullshit over here. Yeah sure. Uh, skip to have all regular automatic. Yeah. Are you ready to start with the yeah I am. So um, I'm super psyched. Super 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 excited. So, uh, as I said, I'm a bit tired, but I got my morning coffee, so we should be all good for about 45 minutes or so. So let's see what 2K Games has done with this. much prettier than I remember it. So yeah, the only Mafia game that I didn't actually complete was the Mafia 3 because I thought it, would, it was too, uh, what do you say, repetitive. It was just doing the same thing, same thing over and over again. So I've actually tried to finish it twice, but Nope. Uh, nope. I didn't. I didn't finish it. So I tried. I tried. Believe me, I tried. But no. Uh, Mafia Two was great. I loved it. Uh, especially the part. Uh, especially the prison part. Fantastic. So uh, Mafia One is iconic. I can't believe it. I, it's iconic. I love it, and and uh, and I see they put some motorcycles in here as well. Uh, I don't think they had that in the original one, though. Uh, uh, well, they didn't because I would have remembered it. So, uh, so that's new. So that will be that. Yeah, that'll be a lot of fun. And I remembered uh, the cars went out of gas and stuff, so you need to stop and refill and. Ah, ah it's awesome! It's awesome! So, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm super, super stoked about this. Well, the cutscene is beautiful. And, uh, well, I know they've done some changes and stuff, uh, but in the original Mafia, I actually knew, I think, about 80% of the map uh, in my head. I actually knew, I think, about 80% of all the streets and everywhere. Uh, I didn't even <laughs> need to look at the map. Well, the same goes for GTA 5, but I mean, I have half a lifetime spent on that game, so. You Tommy? Thomas Angelo, Detective Norman. You alone. <laughs> no self respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just the coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, thanks. Suit yourself. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. 
But if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you called the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any, uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. Can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Well, that's yours. How long you been in town? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up? Yeah. I might have something. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. And no one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. Pa always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. <laughs> Look at you. Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is you got someone powerful mean on your tail and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. <laughs> what? Yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Chris, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed a heater in the nursery, did you? No. <laughs> I was a cab driver back in 30. <laughs> Hi, it's it's amazing. I mostly drove nights, because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts, when I first met Polly and Sam. Shit! Like something okay. taken out of a Scorsese hey. movie. Come on! We're two. Anywhere. Fast. I got a gun pointed at you. They catch up, we're dead. But you don't get to walk away. I don't want any trouble. Well, you got trouble. Drive. How the hell they know we'd be there? It doesn't matter now. We just gotta lose them. Uh, how many cars we got following? One for now. But there'll be more. Hold tight. I'm gonna try some. Who were those guys? You don't get to ask questions. We need to get over the river. Take the Giuliani Bridge. Oh, okay. The leg, okay, up there. Hurts like hell. Oh. I lost Going my back, I'll wake up the dock. I don't know, it might be okay. Just getting the call anyways. Hey, I see oh. you listening, cabbie. You don't get to listen either. All I'm doing is taking you guys where you want to go. So do that. That's so cool. Uh, the guidelines or the waypoints look like small signs. That's so cool.
I can't honk? How do I honk? Oh, uh, I can't honk. Okay. Uh, hey, Cappy! Over the Giuliani Bridge to Central Island! You deaf? Nope. I hear you loud okay, and clear. we're at the river. Where am I taking you once we're over the bridge? I'm getting tired out of questions. And I remember if you crossed the speed limit, the cops would start chasing you. That was also an awesome feature. I love that. Alright, well, hold on, boys. That shit hurts. I know some shortcuts on the slope down. I don't care how, how you would know I it. press you F. Shake them off. Ah, okay, he speeds up a bit when I press F. Huh? Sh oh short shit up. Uh, well, well, sorry. Ah, uh, ah! Uh, gotta, uh, gotta go! Shit, sorry. Sowie. Ah, we're still running. Okay, so this is what we're doing. That was your shortcut. I lost him, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really yeah, yeah, yeah. don't like you, do they? Sometimes business partners fall out. It happens. Quit yapping, Polly. More he knows, more chance of him not seeing the sun come up. I ain't heard a thing, fellas. Sorry. Ow. Oh no. Oh, I double parked. I I double part. I almost screwed up this one. Well, you left them in the dark. We ain't clear yet. Keep driving. Yeah, I'm trying. More bastards digging the road for the works program. Move it. Thank you for this. Three crates down. How many motors were at the exchange? Four, five, maybe. Man, no with him. He's called for more. Sure feels like it. Shit. Next time we take more muscle. We should Yeah, apparently we're oh, just running, running through here and you're just bang. One hell of a wheel, man, I'll give you that. They must huh, have sent word think? out. Thank you. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our own turf. Let's get back to the neighborhood. Okay. Yeah, that shit hurts, of course. Uh back it up. Uh, keep me alive. Keep me alive, please. West Harbor Bridge, cabby, fast. I'm trying. It's a cab. It doesn't go that fast. We're gonna make a right turn here, so hold up. Yeah, um, driving and dying. Act, ah, stop. Uh, the bridge is up, ain't it? Yeah. Yep. We can make it. What the hell are we doing? Just sit tight and pray. Never done that before. Me neither. Okay, so little Italy. Now, your night's not over. I didn't see this coming. You think he squealed? I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at the bar. This is so okay, cool. Close. This is so, so, so cool. Pull over in front of that bar. Silieri's place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? Do you want a little something from the Don or not?
I mean, I'm a horrible driver, but amazing. Compensation for your services, any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Silieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asks where you got that money, you want it at poker. The scratches on your car. You swerved. Scratches. To keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? They're bullet holes. Uh, of course. <laughs> See you around, kid. The scratches are <laughs> bullet holes. A lot of them as well. And I was close to death like three times. When I opened the envelope, I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. <gasps> Amazing. I see. <laughs> After that night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Oh yeah, Are that's right. Driving or loitering? Yeah, driving there was man. like Always three driving. of these. I think there were like three of these missions before so where to I run into them, some bad guys. Saint Michael's Church, directly. Sure thing, madam. Careful, now, please. I just want to know. Uh, controls. Uh, abilities driving horn T. Who has horn on T? Why? There isn't anything else on H, so H. I always drive careful. Then you'd be the first. Ha! Uh, uh, the speedometer. That's what I said. If you drive too fast, the cops will chase. Ah, it's it's awesome. It's Fantastic. It is Turn that racket awesome. off. I can't hear myself think. That's much Absolutely, man. Yep, sure thing. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. Yep, eyes on the road. I mean, from the original, it's wow. It's a revamp deluxe. I mean, the graphics. I mean, the original, you drove like 
it's a, a squared box. I know, it, it, you know that it's a car, but it's still a squared box. I mean, this, this is beautiful. Nothing shorter than beautiful. I look at that church. And the cars and, oh, yeah. Uh, Stop there, by the park. Uh, absolutely, ma'am. There Here you, you go. go. St. Michael's. That'll be 30 cents. The only tip I'll give you is to stop smoking in your vehicle. I felt like I was sitting in an ashtray. Sure. Whatever you say. These Italians are all the same. Yep. Yeah. So, Can't find drive another pair. The radio. Better find a new fare. Okay, where? Or that... It doesn't say. Huh? A new fare. Okay. <laughs> awesome. Uh, there is something over there. What's this? Probably uh, another fair. Yeah, coming. Hello there, good sir. Art gallery. It's Give me there quick. Sure. Yes. Quick, I can do. Okay. So. Hey, watch oh. where you're going. Taking some uh, that's the F out. thing. What's it to you? Uh, Not much. I'll press Just the F. The yeah. I'm okay. paying you to well. drive, so do that. Yep. Driving it is. Look at him out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Sold up before the crash. Ooh. So yeah, I get to be that busy. Was a bit of a lag. Your busy day's gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, drive and quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I get you. People are awfully nice here in Lost Haven. Awfully, awfully nice. I can understand why he turned gangster. Or mobster, I think. It's the correct term. But, but yeah, I can totally understand why. Everybody's so delightful. Yeah. Hog. Ha! Oh, I love the sound of the hawking. Whoop! That was a drunk driver or something. Pull up in front of the gallery. Thanks, pal. Here's 50 cents. I'll spend it all at once. I'll try not to. Every fair today's been a son of a bitch. On to the so next. It's the last one, I think. Well, wait, why do I have? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for all of this, but I need to get this right, uh, right now, or I will never get it right. So speed limiter should be T, because then I can reach it without any troubles. Why should it be L? All the way over there. All right, where you wanna go? Oh boy, you look like shit. I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Moves. Huh. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. All right. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. 
Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Cops see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. <laughs> This city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. Oh, and then I get to meet uh, the mechanic, the stuttering on one. The corner, please. Uh, hey, I can't remember his name. Has a coffee stand around the corner. Awesome. Tell him Lucio sent you. Belts and Take a break, huh? Are the on Thanks. The when it comes to Might just do that. Behringer's menswear has just the thing to access. Jesus! Oh. Hey, how you doing, pal? You remember me? No. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go helping Salieri's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much walking for a while. Eh? <laughs> and now we're running. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Run. Oh, but what? Why did you stop running? Space the ball. Really? Right. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, now they're shooting at me. I even enjoy myself while getting shot. Now that says about uh, a thing or two about the game. Or about me. Get over. Please. Thank you. See ya. Over. 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 And run. Yeah, I'm trying to. Excuse me. Excuse my. Look at this. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou! You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. So anything you gotta say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal, we ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Okay then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. <laughs> Thanks. At least we could do. Come on, let's go say hi to the Don. Don Silieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. That's the Consigliere. Frank, I think. I think, yeah, I think it's Frank. I think it's Frank. Some potluck type party. What do they call you, son? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. 
My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him by the kind of Tommy helping us. This, uh, taxi, that's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm gonna set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Well, I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Frank, yeah. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar he owns. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. Go smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. <laughs> and Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next for you. No one else knows you here, so tread careful, okay? Sure. Okay. The boss finished yet? Nah, you got more time to sit on your ass. Consigliere, I'm writing to let you know my joy to hear that you'll be attending the wedding of my daughter. Please, if there are any further arrangements. I wish you let me know. It will be a wonderful day and for the world to see that the occasion has your blessing. You will make it even more special, memorable. Giovanni Romano. It, it's some, some Scorsese yeah, Godfather thing. It's it's taken right out. It's, it's awesome. It's prohibition here to stay. Uh, yeah, okay. We, we don't need to read all that. That's boring. It's Look, look how handsome I am. I am a handsome fucking fellow. You shouldn't ask me, Carlo. Not gonna give a good answer. Anyways, that's not, that's I got not. places to be. Okay, come through this way. It's I'll take picture. you to Minnie first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go <laughs> see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. Make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. I might be wrong, but from what I remember, the the garage not not the garage the garage the garage was there, but Vinny's place was over there, right up those stairs, those uh, fire ladder stairs things. As I remember it, I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, type it down in the comment section because I I, I really believe it's was right there, in the alleyway. But as I said, I, I might be wrong. Ciao, Polly. Oh, she's gonna sing! <laughs> Who's this then? Benny. This here's Tommy Angelo. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or ruts? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. A baseball bat. This classic should do the <laughs> trick! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Hey, if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Ay, ay, ay. Careful with them, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Tom. <laughs> it's, Let me know if yeah. Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten them out. Absolutely. Ralphie's in the garage. He's a special kind of idiot, but he's got away with cars. Ralphie. I don't get how Ralphie, that's gets the mechanic. Her, but I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. Ralphie. That's the stuttering one, yeah? Hey, genius! <laughs> get your head out of your ass! <laughs> What the fuck, dear Papa Polly? You can't, 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 can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I'm just busting your balls. 
see, see you're still a limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> we ain't nothing hmm. alike. You got that, Ralph? Sh 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 sure, Papa Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. G good to meet you. Like I said, Ralphie here's a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, he'll make it yours. Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Papa Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha 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 ride, but it, it'll get you across the, the, the town. All right, let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> one day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. I don't know what <laughs> Ralph's trying to pull giving us uh. this motor. I want to show you something about the good life, and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cap. You don't have to be nice about it. Spins a tin cap. So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep, new supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop off. And the cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you got a torch, he's got more friends on the floor. Here's a motorcycle. We're okay. As long as we're careful. Keep an eye That's over awesome. our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through, you want a bottle? Just ask. We keep some back for friends. Ah, uh, I'm no big drinker. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but. Not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. The loss, you got a line in the good stuff. Well, that's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. There's tables, there's food, there's skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all Excuse I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure. Sure. Besides, all oh, this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to set fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. Say what you want, but it, it's beautiful. It is. It is beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, it's their cars we're wrecking today, not this junker. I take it easy. What's just a scratch? There's no much of brakes on this one, so. We're getting on to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk in a wrong part of town. You start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. You can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. Uh, it's not a hot run. Okay, it's close by. Smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. They're some lazy bastards. You put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. Over here. I'm right beside you, Paul. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. And Crouch is Crouch, I guess. Uh, X. You know how to go quiet, right? Yeah, like Why? that. Yeah, he's got his main guys. You'll Why? Get there someday. Why? No. Controls. X. Why? Duplicate.
cover. Cover can be C, and that can be left control. Now we're talking, right? No one sees our heads. Yeah. No one tries to pop them. Okay. Get over this gate and up onto their roof. They'll keep their jump busy while you creep up and jump them from behind. You're real good at distracting. The boss gets plenty of guys in the city real pissed. Make some careful. Nope. I get the money on her. Ah, he's good for it. Hey! What the hell are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I mean what I say. What the hell are you doing back there? Who are you? A guy who don't know what idiot told you to keep look out here. Dino. Dino told me. It's like that. Got it. <laughs> okay. Huh? Pick a body. No. Now let's get to these cars. Take it back and huh. start swinging. Okay. Q. What? Why Q? Ah, crap. Hey, get away from the car. Night night. Come on, Tom, quick. There's gonna be more of them. There's a Molotov that might see some flames. What? There we go. <gasps> oh shit. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, that's that's how we throw shit. Oh, it's this one. Oh, blocker. We gotta go. We can take Dino's car. How'd you know this is Dino's car? I don't like you, and you got a good car? I'm gonna know where you go. Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. Oh, huh, what's that? It's right near Morello's place. Oh. Don't bring in the wrong people. Okay. Knock, knock. Old ways are the best ways. Straight through the gate! We gotta get out of here before the bull show! Don't let him get away! Drive! Come back, Drive. you bastards! Oh, 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 shit. We got cops. Yep, so, uh, we do. What do we do? We lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. Spot me if I drive. I passed him. No. Okay. I guess I have to take a take a couple of minutes to remap the controls here because everything is off. I can see the boss. I thought Cilieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How'd it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Taking I'm out the guy. Taking cool. Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. No time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. Had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar joined with Vincenzo. Ten years go by, and I'm still there. Well, I got a suit now, and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family, you had to have more... connections. Your brother, or your uncle, or... Oh, some guys, sure. 
your cousin got made, or you like Carlo, whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. But there's plenty of us who came in off the street. Well, what happened to the car I sent you out with? Dumped it. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. A b better car with a b broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. He's still with you then. Somehow, yeah. Hey, boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not gonna be able to think straight for weeks. See? That's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morella is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands, make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. <laughs> now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you, but you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, I'm we don't deal in that. the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm gonna only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. They're loyal. I may think. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me. You're going to be living the high life, Tom. But you abuse my trust. Don Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay, then. Welcome to the family. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's see. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook. But his daughter Sarah, Maron. Well. I'm all out of coffee, so um, that means we are actually ending this episode right here. Uh, thank you everybody so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoy the video, if you enjoy the game, or if you enjoy me or your life, or the sunshine outside, leave a like uh, on the video. Comment down below what you think about the game. And of course, subscribe to the channel, as always. And I will see you very soon in another episode. Hi, hi.